Hey everybody, my name is Allison Ostrander and I am the Director of Risk Tolerance as well as an Options Specialist here at Simpler Trading. And in this video I'm just going to discuss some of the books that I have read that I feel like have helped me overall in life and my trading journey um, that you might find beneficial to you as well if you haven't read them already. So the first one certainly I want to talk about is Mastering the Trade by John Carter himself. Um, this as well as the newest updated version has really helped with my overall trading, certainly with understanding setups. Um, the book is wonderful. If you haven't read it already, I certainly recommend doing so. I always actually keep it here on my trading desk here at work. So that way, if I need to go back in time to flip through it or anything like that, um, if I have the time during the day to be able to do that while I'm working out of the office or you know, maybe it's a slow market day, I can catch up and reread another chapter, just kind of refresh things in my mind. It's always there and ready and available for me to do so. So that is certainly the first one at the top of my list I would look at if you're starting off trading and want it to get something specific about trading the market overall and how to do so. Um, let me go ahead and minimize myself now and I'll talk about some of the other books <laughs> that I recommend here looking at as a trader, or like I said, that have helped me uh, maybe from more a psychological space in my trading journey. So the next one is called A History of the United States and Five Crashes. And this is actually um, one that I was recommended to from my uncle. My uncle is a economics professor at Hanover University for any of you guys that are out in Indiana. Uh, that's where that university is. And he's taught economics for as long as I can remember. I feel like my entire life he's been teaching economics. And so I visited him um, about a little over a year or so ago, whenever we were expecting uh, the birth of my first daughter. Uh, we had a baby shower. He came down to visit and we were talking and I asked him, you know, about certain books. And he says that this is one that he always has on his reading list for his own students. Um, and he thought it'd be very interesting for me. So this is what I'm currently in the process of reading any time I get the chance to be able to actually sit down and I'm not too exhausted and I'm able to read a little bit at home uh, while taking care of my daughter and things around the house. Uh, this is certainly one that I go to to look at. Um, and so far, it's just been a fantastic read, especially with the whole pandemic situation that's just happened with the drop off that we had in March. I mean, certainly not like any sort of market sell off we've seen in the past. Um, but it's something that is certainly, you know, in the back of my mind, especially as jobless claims continue to still go up as we're still uncertain about, you know, how long much longer this is going to last. I find this to be a very interesting read. So um, certainly one to take in mind and to consider looking at if you haven't picked it up or read it already. Um, it's like I said, recommended by an economics professor. So <laughs> it's definitely uh, one of my go to ones. But yeah, if you uh, go to Hanover College, um, certainly you if you take economics and you have my uncle, this might have already been on your reading list. Otherwise, I think it's a good one to read certainly in the current market environment. Uh, the next two aren't necessarily trading books, but they've kind of helped me from a more um, psychological standpoint on how to just be more mindful of myself about what I want in life and, and therefore within my trading plan. And I found that it still can work over to it. The first one is The War of Art. Um, this has been a fantastic book. It's actually been a little while since I've read it, so I probably am due for another reread of it. Um, but the whole standpoint on how to avoid procrastination, how to make sure you can tackle and get the things that you want out of life, um, this has been a beneficial book for. As some of you may or may not be aware, I was actually a college major with a, a degree in theater performance, a Bachelor of Fine Arts in specific theater performance. Um, and so I read this book while kind of leaving college and things like that, but it still uh, certainly to me applies to my everyday life and it applies to what I do here at Simpler Trading as well as my trading journey. So I certainly recommend it to you guys, especially if you're more creative. Um, you might find it to be a bit more of a beneficial book or if you're like me and you've been a procrastinator uh, most of your life, this is one way um, that might, you know, help you view it from a new mindset, hear it in somebody else's words to kind of 
get your butt into gear and get going um, to be able to get the things you want out of life. And then the follow up to that book is Turning Pro. Um, so it's the next update kind of to that book. This one I found to be very beneficial as well. So if you uh, read the War of Art and you really like that book and you want the follow up to it, certainly Turning Pro is a great next step to go with. I found both of these books to be helpful just in my overall life and what I want from it, like I mentioned. And of course, a lot of the things that I want out of life certainly apply to what I'm doing in my trading and my trading plan and my journey, um, setting up goals, things like that. So I guess you could say they're a little bit more of self-help books, but I have found them to be very beneficial. Um, and I hope, you know, if you haven't read them and you pick them up that you do as well. So those are some of the books that I've read or I'm currently reading um, that have been extremely beneficial to me in my trading journey, whether they're trading specific like John's Mastering the Trade Book or whether they're more just overall about life like uh, The War of Art and Turning Pro. Uh, certainly, I hope these benefit you as well if you decide to pick them up and look through them. Thanks so much for joining me in this video. I look forward to talking to you guys next time. Bye.